member from Park Dale High Park. Thank you, Speaker. My question is to the Acting Premier. Acting Premier, a recently released report on food bank usage in Ontario shows that since 2008, food bank usage has risen nearly 15%. Speaker, the numbers speak for themselves. 90% of food bank users are rental or social housing tenants, 12% are senior citizens living in poverty, 27% of single seniors are now living in poverty in Ontario. Will the Acting Premier admit that her government is absolutely failing vulnerable and impoverished Ontarians? Thank you. Thank you. Responsible for poverty reduction. Thank you, Speaker. And uh, you know, our work on poverty reduction is uh, is strong. It is thoughtful, and it is getting results, Speaker. We acknowledge there is more to be done, but we have started along a path that uh, that is showing real results for people. Speaker, take the example of a single mom with two little kids working full time at a minimum wage job. When we took office. Her income was less than $20,000 a year. She was better off on social assistance than she was working full-time at a minimum wage job. Fast forward to where we are today. That same individual has an income of close to $30,000, a remarkable increase in the well-being of that family. We are focused on, uh, on a number of measures. We are measuring our progress, Speaker, and we have recently announced Answer. a new poverty reduction strategy that we're focused on eliminating chronic homelessness in 10 years. Thank you. Supplementary. Speaker, we recently learned that 48.6% of food banks in Ontario are reporting an increase in use. 34% of food bank users are children. A third of people living in poverty are senior citizens. Those numbers are nothing to be proud of. This government has had 12 years to act on poverty. Speaker, vulnerable Ontarians are falling further and further behind. Will this government finally make fighting poverty a priority? Not in 10 more years, now. That is exactly what is happening, and I know that the member opposite has read that report from the Ontario Association of Food Banks, as have I and many others on this side, and we were very, very pleased to see that this year there was a drop of about 4 percent, a drop in visits to food banks, Speaker. That is not uh, the only way to measure progress, but that is a very encouraging statistic, Speaker. As I say, we have taken several steps, and we now have a willing federal partner, something yes. we have not had for the past decade. We have a federal partner who is making a commitment through the Canada Child Benefit that will exceed our target of reducing child poverty by 25 percent. We always knew we couldn't do it alone. We always need, we knew that we needed support across governments, and finally we have that support, and I'm excited Answer. about that, Speaker. Thank you.